so uh, you were in camp with Stephen Fulton. Yeah. Raining for Raw test positive for COVID. Yeah. yeah. No date yet on the fight. Yeah. What was your thoughts on it? The funny thing is when you when you be in the gym talking about this shit, we be we be joking. And then the shit happened. It happened for a reason though. Ain't nothing I can do about it. I'm not on the business end of that fight. Um I was called in to help him out. That's it. Get ready for the next one. If you call me in, you call me in. If not, what's the psychology behind that? You you're ready. You know, you, you cut weight, now you gotta start the camp all the way over again. It's draining. It's draining. It's like you almost gotta go do something extreme that can match match the the the, out, the, uh, the magnitude of the fight just to get that rush out of your body, and then you gotta start over again. It's kind of like that. It's, it's burn, it, it'll burn you out though. If you don't know how to approach it, it'll burn you out. What I said to him was, depending on the date, take a week or two off. And the reason being, because you because you can go into the fight too wound up and not unwind. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We don't want that. Now, a, a lot of times, well, at least nowadays, when somebody tests positive for COVID or say they test positive for COVID, now everybody automatically thinks that they just weren't ready. And yeah. they're using COVID as an excuse. Yeah, it's possible. Because it's another tactic. Who go... Who gonna say Figaro was lying? Who gonna say he's telling the truth? You don't really know. Nobody's not gonna call the doctor, question the doctor. Nobody's gonna call his camp and ask for paperwork. You're not gonna do it, especially because I believe he's the favorite. Nobody's not gonna question him. You know what I'm saying? Who boy already testified a year ago. So it was the Figaro return, as far as I see. I don't even worry about the tactics no more. Fuck it. We just gotta do what we gotta do. Who do you think the postponement favors? Who boy? Cause you making him mad now. Pissing him off. He he known as cool boy. He like to keep it cool, but pissing him off now. So I mean, he really got a mission. He really wanted to distract. He wanted to, he wanted to really be unified. That's all he talked about. That's all he been talking about for a few years now. Mm. You know what I mean, this would be his ninth undefeated fighter. Yeah. And what is it? Less than 20 fights. He ain't got 20 fights yet. Right? That's impressive. It is. That's impressive. Thanks, G. I appreciate it.